So Anne has a question. Um, um, on the insurance as well. So um, you mentioned last week uh, getting, did you really get a traditional insurance of a bond? I mean, there's different ways you can do insurance as well. There's bonds. Okay, there's let's let's, talk, about, let's bonds. talk about that. If you've got enough cash, hundred dollar bills in the bank and you can prove it, uh, you can, you can take that deposit slip. You can put it in a separate uh, trust account called your, your trust liability account in your name at the bank and take that information to DMV and they will give you a card that's like a this person is self-insured doesn't need insurance card and it shows though that you are under full financial liability if you should get in a wreck and hurt someone you better be able to take the cash out of the bank and buy them a new car or pay yeah. their medical bills and and okay, there's that's no called bond. being self-insured. Yeah. Yeah. And even self-insured, you can create assurance trusts, which have been done throughout history since anything. Right. And as long as that assurance trust has assets, um, which you don't have to prove to anybody because it's a private contract. But if I was, you know, I wouldn't want to have an assurance trust with nothing in it. Um, because uh, that would a be million or a two million dollar liability bond is another way. You take that to DMV, yep. they'll show that you're bonded and, and insured, and you're done. Yep. So, so Tim, I, I hope that answered your question there. Um, so yeah, Tim, again, you can always form a ministry, all ministries are faith based, and you know. I think the scripture is pretty clear that if you have the faith of a mustard seed, well, you can do just about anything. So you definitely can have a faith based ministry. We all have them. So if you're telling anybody anything that you know as fact, that is your ministry. And if you know that, you know, what, what, whatever, you know, nobody is allowed to determine your faith for you. Faith is very self determined. Um, you know, the, the constitution is very clear about your own self-determination. So the only problem you run into is when you don't determine it for yourself and you allow someone to determine it for you. So it, it's, it's not even something that you should do. It's something that you have to do. So, you know, it, on, on, as far as creating a ministry trust, it's a faith-based organization and it's based on your faith. Um, you know, it's common law under ecclesiastical law. And these are things that you must do. They're not things that you should do. These are things that you must do to operate under God or with